It is a season of promises, but who is promising the most? It is evident the NPP flag bearer, Dr. Mahmoud Baumi, enjoys taking a swipe at his opponent, John Mahama. Here is another one from him. He wants a Kuko Kiti Kiti and 24 hour disco. The bus is in Wale Wale and the mate is going to take it from Wale 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 and get to Paga and beyond. And we will transform this country. And John Ba, a competent Mahama administration. <laughs> M MPP is going to come and transform Ghana in one, one and a half years. <laughs> And factory, ma. <laughs> the NDC has been clamoring for an independent audit of the voters' register, but the EC is having none of that. The EC has a nice explanation to the NDC's demands. Perhaps this is the first time the NDC has taken interest in the register. Otherwise, one would have expected them to call for such an audit of the 2016 register which contain photos of plants and animals representing voters. They may be considered underdogs in the electoral race, but they are not taking the elections lightly at all. The APC's Hassan Ayariga and LPG's Kofi Akpalu are slagging it out. I win this election. Mm. I win this election. And where the results are going to, where the votes are going to come from, myself, I don't even know. Mm. But I know one thing for sure, that I win this election. Okay. I win. I'm the next president of that. Nobody can change it. Oh, wow. He's dreaming, and I want him to wake up. Kofi is still dreaming. When he's awake, then we can discuss the issues. And you remember this, right? Well, that was President Ekufuado in 2020, but the NDC flag bearer John Romani Mahama has a remix. Uh, from Bwafakwatano uh, uh, time, no? As, oh, Bwafakwatano, uh, uh, yes, Unyani. Bono, hey. Where the man can hear crack, 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 crack. Until the elections are over, you can always trust us to bring you more of the funny quotes on the campaign trail. And of course, politics in Ghana should never be boring. Prince Kwame Kudoges report for Joy News.